Jen was doing her thing. <laughs> oh, okay. Welcome back to the channel. I'm Hank Strange. This is Stranger Palooza. And today we're at Sea Sucker, obviously, in Bradenton, Florida. We're here with Jen. You guys saw Jen on the channel hey recently. And she, you're the COO yes. of, of Sea Sucker. Because yes, folks sir. were like, you know, that lady that was on, she's awesome. Uh, kudos to whoever hired her. That would be this guy. <laughs> <Maybe>. <laughs> this would be Chuck, the founder of Sea Sucker. And uh, we, we've got both of these guys here today because Jen had a great idea. Five things, five accessories that you absolutely need on your Class B camper van. Right, Jen? Five things. Five things. We're going to get into it right now. Let's do it. Perfect. <laughs> Ooh, the good transition. Oh, Hey everyone, a new Vanasaur t-shirt design is out, just in time for the winter season. It's called Winter Camping Fun. Even here in the Sunshine State, it feels a lot like winter. If you're a fan of outdoor life, then this is a great way to give someone you care about a gift or get something for yourself and support this channel at the same time. All you have to do is follow the link here on YouTube, just below the video description to the Stranger Palooza store, where you will find this Winter Camping Fun design and other fun, cool Stranger Palooza gear. <laughs> All right, guys. So um, these are actually some brand new stuff that Sea Sucker has out. So I'm going to let Jen run us down this, but I think we should start with the party barge. First and most importantly, the portable bar. Yeah. yeah. First and most importantly. Absolutely. Gotta have it. You know, you really need this. Yeah, yeah. After a hard it. day of RVing. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. You gotta relax. So. 100%. So what we have here is, we call it our party barge. And if you're looking online, just type in party barge. You'll find it on csucker.com. And it's great. It'll vacuum mount right to the side of your van or RV. And all of a sudden you can fit to handles, mixers, pop cans, and anything in between so that you can make sure that you have a place for all of your alcohol when you're camping because who Absolutely. doesn't camp without it? Yeah, that's just me? I, I, <laughs> I know, I know, I'd say I, I go with some alcohol and there's some good selections here. So uh, let's start with uh, what price category is this in? This so is available now on the site, right? This is available yeah. right now at mm -hmm. $249 okay. MSRP with, with everything but the booze and, right. and the drinks, obviously, that you see here. Mm -hmm. It comes in both white and in black, okay. which is really nice. I know a lot of people like it to is. have that. Yeah. Like to have that diversity. Yeah, if you want to match everything, uh, you know, have it all be the same color. If you want to have it all Very look nice. totally pro, yeah. but but each one of these vacuum mounts, a lot mm -hmm. of people are like, do you really trust suction cups with the whole bar set up like this? What yeah. is, what's gonna happen? Is it gonna fall off? I'm telling you. So these are vacuum mounts. Each one is pull tested, 210 pounds of pull strength each. So we're talking over 420 pounds. So, I mean, you can really see, like I can put my whole body weight wow. on this. Okay. It's not going anywhere. And if it does ever leak, you'll see it. There's a button, we pump this up. Okay, so this so is an indicator. An indicator. It'll yeah. tell you if you've lost any power. You don't have to take it off and lick it. You just pump it right back up. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah, that's good to know. So once you do it like this, how long does that last before you need to like check on it and see? So every single cup goes through QC to make sure it'll last at least 24 hours. Mm -hmm. But honestly, with these mounts, you typically see it last about a week. And okay. again, that yeah. indicator is there to let you know if you're ever losing any sort of right. suction. So when it starts to go, you can just yeah. hit it yeah. Get yeah. right back. Now you're not going to have this on the side of your van driving down the road for no. a week. <laughs> no. You could. You, yeah. you could. You're you going to get in trouble. Yeah. You might get I a little promise in trouble. You. Yes. you might get in trouble, but you absolutely can. You yeah. absolutely can. Yeah. Um, and it's great because it, it actually is very, very like portable. You know, honestly, it's not that tall. You can kind of just shove it under a seat and then just take it out when you need it. Yeah. It's great. Yeah, absolutely. Now, something you can go driving down the road with your van is the recovery setup here. So tell us about this. Yeah, so these are our recovery mounts. And so we do use these with Max Tracks and other recovery boards, but this same recovery mount system can also be used for jacks and other things because what you get when you buy that recovery mount is these four pieces here with these dials. And this is basically like a universal system, right? I mean, Dad, what did we have on the Gladiator 
When we were in Vegas, we I had think that's what we saw. This, we put all kinds this? of things. Yeah. We've done an axe. So we had to drill little holes in the yeah. axe to get that part yeah. through. But then you can put the axe on the vehicle too. Yeah, but yeah. I think we had an axe. Poles, we had a shovel. shovel shovels. We had, um, and of course, the the max tracks, and yeah. then a and a big heavy jack. Yep. And yep. we drove that Gladiator here from Florida all the way to Vegas with this on with those heavy jacks on. With jack's the, still on now, yeah. yeah the jack is actually has not it's left. It's too heavy to take off, I just leave it on. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so once again, that's the same thing as with this, right? So you probably want to check the, is that, what do you call that, a valve? Check or, valve, yeah. Check yep. valve, yeah, you want to check that and then you don't have to take it off or do anything, right? Nope. Just nope. push it down. Pump it back up. Pump yeah. it back down and I'm telling you, I mean, honestly, after a few days, maybe you'll start to see some orange, mm -hmm. but, but that's about it. And but I'm, you know it. You, you yeah. know it, and it's super easy just to re-pump up, and this is a great solution for people who are not wanting to permanently mount big, ugly metal brackets into the side of their vehicle. Yeah, and if you are worried, I'm sure someone's going to ask us, well, what keeps people from stealing it? You know, um, you, can't t you can easily take it off and put it away, right? You can easily take it off and put it away. Right? Yeah. It it away. Yeah. The other thing I will say is that um, with things like these recovery mounts, mm -hmm. you can always lock it with a simple cable lock, and we do have solutions um, at seasucker.com. Oh, you do? Okay. We do yep. have solutions. You can stick one of our cable anchor trunks or one of our cable anchor windows, either into the door, uh, into the, the trunk, or yeah. into the window. Okay, so and like here on the back door lock. or something. A little loop of uh, metal yeah. that comes yeah. out, and then yeah. you can use any okay. lock you Oh, very cool. Yeah. Or like if I've got some, some metal back here yep. already, I could just easily Easy. loop to it. Yeah. Easy. So there you go. You can leave it on there. And then, you know, if something happens and you don't pay attention to it, then that'll keep it. You'll hear it. Yeah, <laughs> you'll hear it. But I, I'm gonna tell you, so long as you're, if you check it once a day, mm -hmm. it's not gonna be. Stop an issue. to get fuel. Just take a look. Yeah, we're good. Yeah. Now you guys are not selling the boards themselves. You're just nope. selling nope. the just suction selling, cups. Yep. There's so the, many different versions of, yeah. of recovery mounts, and everyone has their own favorite. We love Max Tracks. Yeah. We're a little biased, but yeah. you know, a lot of people have their own preferred. But these are universal, and so no matter what recovery mount that you have. These are gonna. These are gonna work for you. Okay. Very nice. Very nice. What What do these go for? Um, that goes for two nineteen mm -hmm. for all four of these that you see here. Two nineteen. Okay. Very nice. Okay. Cool. Now remember, like I know people probably asked this. You said it yep. before. This stuff. Everything's made here, right? Or most of what you guys are making made, are made here, here in, in America. Yep. In Florida. In Florida. Here. In Bradenton, Florida. We're we're truly truly lucky. We have a twenty thousand square foot manufacturing facility mm -hmm. here in Bradenton, Florida. We have 44 amazing employees, most of which are actually out on the warehouse floor. Mm -hmm. We have five injection molding. Yep, injection molding machines. We have CNC, CNC table routers. We have full CNC equipment, mills, lathes. Yeah. I mean, so our we- Full design team. We have yeah. uh, four people in R&D, yeah. yep. full time. Full, yeah. full and all time. These guys, here you, too. you guys have some really cool things, but what's the most exciting to me is you can pretty much make anything. Yeah. You've got lots of ideas in the works, right? That's what I do. I think we have 70 items in the R&D yeah. right now, so we have to constantly prioritize what 15 or 20 to work on for the next month right. or two. Yeah. That's more of the issue, but, but yeah. we love it. We're always coming in doing new things. I have to go out fishing, boating and biking to you figure out guy. the next product. Yeah. You know? That's really, suffering. Got to do it. It's really rough. <laughs> it's, it's really rough so for him. Tough. Yeah. <laughs> really, so, really rough. Speaking of things that you absolutely need, like recovery boards, yep. like, you know, your drinks and entertainment, water so extra water rotopacks maybe you need extra gas yep exactly right? so, so so this rotopax mount is also new for us it's available on the site um and let me tell you this is great so these rotopax tanks can fit water fuel they fit up to two gallons so that can either be two one gallon tanks some people like to stack them mm -hmm. or two two gallon tanks next to each other if you're doing it that way mm -hmm. white for water mm -hmm. red for fuel Right. important to to remember yes, that distinction absolutely. and not confuse Don't that the twain mix no yeah. no no no. but uh -huh. so this is also available and it's the same system that you see with all of our products it's also vacuum mounted so you can avoid again those like annoying metal contraptions you have to permanently drill into the side of yeah. your van yeah and figure out like this position might not work for you you can move it around this is on the door right now but i could put it anywhere that i want to on the van if I don't want it to be on the door, it is positioned here right now because of the next thing that we're going to go to. Obviously, I'm going to ask you what this is. And by the way, you guys will have a link in the description of the video that you guys can go to and go through that link and, and get yep. this stuff from Seasucker. Um, so what price are we looking at here? It's one suction mount. 
It is. So there's actually here. Let's see if I can. Oof, I apologize. Let's see if I can get it. There we go. I'll show you actually. Yep. So this is the unit. It doesn't come with the Rotopax hardware, but everything else that you see here comes with this unit and it retails 169, I think, but we will correct in the comments yeah, if that's, if that's yes. not right. I believe yeah. it's 169. Um, and again, everything you see here, minus just this mounting hardware, but this deck and these two vacuum mounts, and then these are those six inch cups again. So 210 pounds. Oh, so this, pounds, yeah, this is, yeah. So these each. are two, yeah. Yeah, that's yep, what you 100%. need to realize. So that's pretty good. And then when these get filled, <laughs> they, they add some heavy. weight. Yeah, that's yeah. Why have two so that's why you're going with two. Okay, yep, that's very good. Exactly why we're going All right. with two. Awesome. So you need water for lots of different reasons, or fuel, extra fuel. And in this case, you guys actually have like a table kitchen sink. We do. We saw this at the show. What is this? We do. This is our kitchen station. Super Ooh. exciting. Um, this was the one product at SEMA that everybody asked about mm -hmm. doesn't matter who you are mm -hmm. what you're driving those that are having their their jeeps and they're going off-roading interested in the kitchen station those with rvs mm -hmm. those with vans i mean yeah. i'm telling you well you always need a surface to prepare food or put snacks on or even just put tools or something super yeah workstation useful. yep yeah but yeah. Super, super useful yeah. everything goes on here from paper towels yeah. to uh, spice yeah. rack. This is an addition. The paper towel was it? I don't think you guys had that at the show. So yeah. since it's coming out now, we've got it added there. That's very convenient. Uh, Super convenient. Yeah. So, so I'll take you through it real yes, quick, just so everyone yep. kind of knows what's available on the mm -hmm. site. So we have this kitted out in its entirety here, and you can purchase everything you see as one unit. But we also have smaller base unit, just in case you want to just start with maybe one thing, and then for Christmas and then maybe for birthday upgrade. and you can continue to upgrade. <laughs> yeah. So that base unit is gonna come with everything you see here over. So it's gonna come with this um, cutting station, this workstation here, which mm -hmm. is food safe, by the way, for those wondering, this yeah. HDP and it is food safe. Comes with the spice rack or sort of, this is just a great section for anything for mm -hmm. storage. Comes with the paper towel holder and it also comes with this waistband section that you see here which is gonna hold your trash or recyclables. We do include the four ocean um, bag as well, which I just love. Um, I always tell people like, if it's not trash, also like wet towels, yeah. anything that gets a little grody, this four ocean bag is great because it's also machine washable, which yeah. is a huge added So what benefit. is four ocean for the folks out there that don't know? Not me, I totally know. So what four, is four ocean, ocean is this, <laughs> great company that Steve Secker has a pleasure to work with okay. um, and what they do is they help eliminate trash from the ocean so oh, they've actually awesome. created a for-profit business mm -hmm. their profits go towards trash cleanup actually all around the world okay and so they are super into everything being recycled obviously yep. Yep. and sustainability and so yep. this four ocean bag is made completely from recycled materials which okay is cool really really awesome and it's a great cost yeah great cost. yeah don't leave it at the beach or anywhere else that you go yeah, yeah. exactly okay. and so so this is that base unit mm -hmm. and then you can just kind of keep stacking on and stacking on so we also have, this is our sink attachment that you're gonna see here. Um, and it does come with this, um, this basin. Um, and so that's also an additional add-on. Another add-on is this section that you see here. This is actually where, and I don't know if you can tell, but there's a, there's a racking underneath here, which is gonna allow you to slide in Tupperware and other containers. And let me tell you why I love, love, love this is because when I'm, cutting stuff up and preparing food here I'm gonna take my knife and I'm just gonna throw everything into this Tupperware right here and it's super convenient um, that's how I use it that's how we use it when we yeah. when we go camping and we just we love it we yeah. absolutely love it okay and of course you got the sink so the sink. you know you could run water down here you could wash things off or you could have uh, some other materials yep exactly you know, if in, you're in this basin go through is here and washed this basin's super nice because mm -hmm. it comes with this where you can either have it so that the water's going to run through or you can make it tight so it'll actually hold water, which mm -hmm. is great. So if you're washing out dishes or something like that and you're getting a bunch of water in here, it's getting soapy, it's getting mm -hmm. a little gross, then you want to just release that water at the end. It's easy. But it's easy. also collapsible. Mm -hmm. it's, it's compact. All these pieces come apart and can You could easily store, store it inside. In a small little section. Mm -hmm. 
Give it a little hug yeah. here. Yep. Tuck it under something. It's all yep. very, exactly. very small. Yeah. Everything here is very, very, very much collapsible. So all of these pieces can disconnect, including the vacuum mount, super easy. And then you're just going to store all of this flat. Mm -hmm. It takes us, what would you say, 30 seconds to a minute to yep. set up? So, yeah. Super mm -hmm. easy. Super, yeah. Super easy. And what I like about it is it. You know, because you have this, it means you can come up with different pieces for this. Yeah, it could be some future, future items for sure. Yeah. Easy so to have. How much weight can the table, can it take? So, the vacuum mounts themselves, like we mm -hmm. said, 210 pounds of pull mm -hmm. strength. We don't necessarily recommend going over 75 pounds or so okay. worth of stuff. But I'll say one of our engineers... That's a lot. <laughs> this is a lot. One of our engineers was actually... Um, standing on it the other day for product testing he didn't hurt anything and he didn't go to the emergency room so we take that as a victory right well it actually has a, it, it has a buttress support if you can okay. get the camera in behind this okay you can see the piece at the bottom that kind of comes back to the vehicle yeah. so that gives you a little buttress so that hits the vehicle down lower and it gives it a little extra support it keeps yeah. it there well and the reason why i was asking is maybe if you have a grill or something like we have one of those smaller electric grills you could plug in yeah definitely that weight can go sure. on here and you could sure. use it so yeah. yeah that's very convenient if uh if it works for you having it on this side of the van you can have it here you can flip it over you can put put it wherever uh it works for you so very good and uh going on to another thing that you definitely need cup holders cup holder i'll tell you this is i think our third most popular seller on our website and it's because it's so universal mm -hmm. you can use a cup holder in your car in your jeep on your van on your boat we sometimes we go mountain biking all the time and we'll sit on the back of the tailgate and put these up it's okay. just super easy and super convenient and it's again the same technology that you see on everything everything's vacuum mounted so it's super easy to take off and on so you can see you're just going to lift up on this tab down here uh, to okay. release and then that pops out yep so all uh, you're doing by by um by pressing on that tab is just allowing a little bit of air to come under that vacuum mount and that's what's releasing it and then to attach super easy you're just going to apply a little bit of pressure to make sure that entire ceiling edge is touching the vehicle and then you're just going to pump until that orange indicator band disappears you're locked in and loaded and ready to go Right. That's why it's vacuum suction, right? Exactly. Yeah. So there is a big difference over what you see with normal suction cups. Yep. Those clear, yeah. dingy suction cups <laughs> where you're just waiting to hear that thing yeah. fall in the back of your van because you know it's about it to. They're, to me they're all going to release eventually. Time. These will eventually leak out, and, and yeah. the difference is you see it. Yeah. After so much time, you see it. Yes. Yeah, I like the fact know. you can see it. Check on it. It's really easy and quick for you to maintain it and keep it going. So absolutely, um, that's very nice. Uh, suction mount. Uh, you guys will find all of this on the website. So yep, absolutely, light. Light is really important, I think, because if let's say you were cooking here, it started to get dark. It's great to have light. But let's say you were dumping or something like that on the other mm -hmm. side of the van or fixing something, maybe fill, uh, putting air in the tires. It's good to have light that you can move around. You can tell us, anywhere. yeah, tell us about that. It's a pretty, it's a really solid flex arm. Wherever you mm -hmm. bend it, it's just gonna stay right there, mm -hmm. which is nice. So it's a very bright light. We also have a built-in LED uh, uh, red light as well for night vision. If you mm -hmm. want to not blind yourself, you can go to the red light at night. Mm -hmm. But this this goes in and out and gives you a little bit more of a beam oh, or see. less of a beam. And very nice. So this is a anywhere. Sea Sucker branded light. This comes with the arm and the, and the suction. All this comes together, yep, okay. as a kit. Okay. Yep. What's the name of this, Jen? Um, this is our heavy-duty flash light mount, and mm -hmm. it retails at $99 MSRP. Okay. You if go. you just type in flashlight into the search on our website, you'll find it. But you can also find it on our RV or Overland or any of our camp collections on our website. Okay. And it's rechargeable? Yes, it is rechargeable. Okay. Yeah. Very absolutely. good. All right, so do you want to do the bonus? Let's do a bonus. I know yes, we said absolutely. five, right? Yeah, but, but I think this is really important. So. Because, you know, if, I think if someone is do is interested in what you guys do with these vacuum suction yeah. mounts, but they don't know, like, yeah. I don't know if it works yeah. or not. What I would do is just get one thing yep. and try that out. And I think that what we're going to talk about here, you could try it out and put it inside the van, outside the van, all over the place, do a lot of things with it. So, Absolutely. Yeah. I, I totally agree. If you're going to get one thing mm -hmm. and you really want to make sure it's something you're going to use and mm -hmm. you can use a bunch of different places, this is our utility uh, hook. Yep. This is our bonus item, yep. number six. 
And I really think that this is super useful for honestly hanging bags. I hang coolers towels, off of this. Towels, yeah. yeah. Sometimes I'll even hang the four ocean bag off of this yeah. when I have an actual trash bag mm -hmm. attached to the kitchen station. Um, really anything. anything. So Lola and I have some uh, electric scooters. Mm -hmm. And so what I was thinking is that, you know, so they fold. Yep. And then, yep. but they'll fall down all the time. So you could you could Keep really mount position. this any way you, you want to, right? Go ahead and, and pump then, it up and show. So, pump, so, so you push bit. it in. Push it in. Pump. And then pump, 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 pump. Just like that. There you go. Ah, there you go. And so it's easy to pull up. But so what Chuck's doing is what Jen showed us. If you pull up on that, it's easy, right? You just bend that back, and it pops right yeah. off. Yeah. We'll pump that up and put the bag on. So how much is the hook? The hook is $69 on our website. So it's very affordable. It's mm -hmm. one again, if you want a quick grab and go item just to test everything out, this is it. There you go. So Jen, if someone's looking if they need parts or they want to know about your warranty. Yep. So what is so that? let me let me tell you guys, we do have a limited lifetime warranty, which basically means if there's any issues that you have that's coming from the manufacturer coming from us. We're gonna go ahead and replace that for you, no questions asked. Okay. But let me tell you, over time, people do silly things. People step on vacuum mounts, they break pumps, they don't use the protective covers, mm -hmm. all of a sudden your they're vacuum Your dog chews it. Your dog chews, <laughs> seriously, we've had that happen. You'd be surprised how yeah. many vacuum mounts inside this building have little dog marks on them. Mm -hmm. But we have so many replacement parts. We want these things to last you guys a full decade, and we don't want you to have to always replace the yeah. whole unit. Yeah. So the beautiful thing is, actually, Dad, will you pass me that utility hook? Yep. So the beautiful thing about all of our products, everything on this vacuum mount is modular and replaceable. So the pump can be replaced. The vacuum pad can be replaced. Um, so to perform a little bit of maintenance, all you're going to do is pull that pump out. And I don't know if you can see here, but there's this little rubber gasket. This guy's been on the road for a little bit. So you can see there's not a ton of silicone lube in here all of your products will come with a little bit of silicone lube it also will come with a spare pump which is nice mm -hmm. but all you're going to do is put a little pea sized bit of that silicone lube just grease that back up and put that back in we recommend maybe doing that about once a year oh, okay. just to keep the pumps um keep the pumps fresh yeah. keep them from drying out i heard that pop when you took it out so uh, the suction's happening right in there obviously yep. yeah so it's really that's where the magic easy. happens that, this is where the magic yeah, happens folks is. the pump's important the mm -hmm. pump is very important super easy to replace and also same is true for that cup pad let's say that that dog chewed the cup pad mm -hmm. or something ridiculous just replace the pump all pad. you do yeah. is you're going to just unscrew these four housing screws here and you're just going to replace the the cup pad all of those replacement parts are also available online on our store. They range for anywhere from eight to about $12 to okay. replace all these different yeah. pumps. Yeah. Super affordable, yeah. super reasonable. Yeah, I think when people are buying these, they're making an investment. These aren't yep. cheap, but that's a good thing. You guys yep. are making them here, like we said. So that helps you to continue your investment and makes it worth it for you. If yep. It's usable over a long time, like we said. Yeah, this is the thing. A lot of people are like, oh, $75 for a cup holder. Mm -hmm. I'm like, well, guess what? It's $75 that you're gonna spend one time you're gonna invest that $75 and not ever have to spend it again mm -hmm. because our products are so well made and because all of the parts are so modular and replaceable. Yeah. And so again, it's a little bit more money, but what are you gonna do? Spend $40 on a cup holder that doesn't work? Right. I would rather spend that extra 35, know it's gonna work and know that it's gonna last at least a decade. Yeah, and then I think in the van world and a lot of RV or boating world, you know, if you get your, if you get whatever it is and you start making things to hold this, like adding places mm -hmm. to hold cups mm -hmm. and all that, when you sell it or trade yeah. it, then you don't have those things anymore. This you. stuff you could just take with you. So with you. when we really do our works. boat shows, this, we have people come back into the booth 15 years. This yeah. my mm -hmm. cup's 15 years old and it's still working. Yeah. Yeah. Every show we go to, yeah. we have people, they, they like to bring it in and show it to us. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I've been seeing these guys for a long time. What made me excited was I, I was seeing you guys doing bicycle stuff. Sure. You know, uh, I've been coming to SEMA for a while. But when I saw that you had a van stuff, RV overlanding stuff, I was very excited. So I yeah, appreciate we're, it. We're, uh, we're uh, excited about getting into it. The, uh, the octopus has three hearts. 
Three Did hearts. You know three hearts. So three really, hearts. Now we have our third heart. Wow. He texted me that the other day. It was wow. very yeah. inspiring. I did he not like, know that. <laughs> three hearts in an octopus, and wow. now Seasucker has three product lines. That's Marine, right. Rack, and Camp. Uh, yeah, very cool. <laughs> and he's living the life, man. He's a really nice octopus Oh, yeah. Man. I always had my octopus bling yeah. on. Absolutely. <laughs> 100%. Like I said already, all of this stuff is, we'll, we'll have a, something in the description. You guys could check that out. But big thanks to Jen and Chuck for, you know, having us over here at the factory. Oh, well, thank you for coming. Yeah, you came, you, I mean, how long was the drive? You guys came a few hours, right? Yeah, about three hours. Yeah. Thank you guys for nice coming. Drive. Nice, yeah, nice to be here. It's your old stomping grounds. Yeah. I know. It's actually, I went to yes. my old stomping grounds. I know, I know. I heard this. I heard this. Go Gators, sorry. <laughs> yes. So, if, yeah, if people are looking and they want to find out more, how can they do that? So, to find out more, you can just come to seasucker.com, S-E-A-S-U-C-K-E-R, Dot com, or you can check us out on any of our social channels. We have Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, YouTube, and we have a great customer service team that's ready to answer any and all of your questions in a second. So. Right. And how can people go fishing with Chuck? How do we make that Oh, happen? anytime. I just need an excuse. Yeah. You just yeah. got to knock on his front door <laughs> and he will actually yeah. be ready to This to catamaran is no joke. Before we actually end it, <laughs> yeah. Lola, you got to show this thing. It's awesome. Yeah, we've, we've totally had this out in the Bahamas, we take yeah. it out in the Gulf, we go out 140 okay. miles. Yeah, you know, I've never been to the Bahamas, Chuck. I'm just saying, I don't, you know, I don't know if I knew someone with. that could take me oh, out yeah. there, man. We'll do I, it. It's I, no different. <laughs> I got batteries just like you. Yeah, it's the same yeah. thing. Yeah. Beautiful, yeah. So if you see, if you see the octopus on there, you know what it is. <laughs> All right, guys, we're out of here. Thanks for watching. We appreciate you guys. We'll see you on the next one. Peace.